All right, guys, Brian Tong here outside of the CES Convention Hall. We're here at the kind of gold parking lot. This is outside the North Hall. And what we're going to show you here, we're here at Ford's vehicle to vehicle detection system. They're going to show a demo off. And we're just going to show you two things that makes this really cool. This is kind of the future coming to your cars. But the first thing that we want to talk about is a reveal, right? You have these cars, a situation, for example, where you have three cars driving down in a line. Now, what happens is we have a lead car down in the back, and you'll see it coming up. A lot of times, if you have three cars in a row and you're that far back car, you don't know that there's actually one more car in front of you. All of a sudden, car number two peels out, reveals that car, and then your car stops. Now, what happens in this detection system is that there's an array of LED lights that warn you. There's an audible sound, and also when cars are near you, there's a vibration system in the seats to let you know whether a car's on your left side or your right side. So, this is just one of those cool examples here that they're showcasing off the technology. Now, Ford is working on this in partnership with eight other OEMs. So, this is not just specific to Ford, it's their driver assistance system. And so, what we're going to want to do now is kind of show you we're going to jump in the car and maybe kind of explain this a little more. When we get inside, but let's just kind of go this way, guys. This, this is cool stuff. Um, before we hop in, I just want to point out one thing about this technology. Up here, you see the shark fin here. Now, this is a transmitter that transmits 10 times per second. It's an, it, it includes Wi-Fi and GPS data. And what this does is these this system talks to other cars. Again, it's not manufacturer specific. It is still being it's still in the works. This is not a prototype though. This is getting pushed forward, and all it takes is for the National Highway Transportation Safety Administration to push this through as a standard. But this is this again, this is not anything beta or a, a hacked up project. This is going and moving forward, and this is really the future of cars across multiple manufacturers. So what we're gonna do now is jump in this car and show you one other demo to show you how this all works. Okay, so give us some time. We're gonna I'm gonna jump in the front. Charlie and Sarah are gonna jump in the back, so just bear with us for a second. We're gonna load up, okay guys? Look, I'm right. Look, I can see you guys still. Okay. Now, I will do the talking here. Nick, our driver, he's going to be, you know, he's here. He needs to pay attention to the road, obviously. So, we're going to check this out. This is, um, I guess, this is a demo where if you're driving at an intersection and you're going to be at a stoplight, you may not see oncoming traffic. So, what we're going to do is we're here inside the car. You might be able to see this, uh, a light sign on our left side. But what happens is we can't see anything on our right side because we're being pretty much covered by a Penske moving truck. So we're gonna go give it a second for this demo to go on. And then you'll see how this all comes together. All right. Green means go. Go motion. Okay, so here we go. Let's see what this looks like. I should buckle up too. <laughs> Ugh. Safety first, guys. All right, whoa, there's some speed. Oh, okay, now you guys just saw that you heard the audible noise. I actually felt that rumble in my chair. That's indicating the driver to stop, as well as a LED array lights up to let you know that you need to slow down. So again, this is Ford's demo of their vehicle to vehicle system, uh, you know, detection system, warning system for drivers. And again, um, just one of the cool demos you guys can check out here at CES. These are going to be coming down the road. There's no set date right now. Again, this has to be approved to push through, but this is a standard that's coming to car soon, and we will check you guys out more with CES 2014.